All right, well, as you can see, it's this is my favorite time of the year. Uh, we're in the uh, Kaimichi Mountain Range, southeastern Oklahoma. And uh, the foliage is beautiful. It's just starting to change, actually. Um, so, in this trip, I'm kind of just going to break away from all the madness in the world and just going to hike and you know, kind of see what, uh, what we can find, enjoy. Such a crazy year. Now it's time to lose my mind and find my soul, so to speak. So, into the woods we go. So this is this is just right. You start getting away from the road, you start losing road noise, and start finding, uh, start just hearing the wind in the trees and this is like the most foliage I've caught in, since I've been here. I've never caught it where it's actually it's beginning to change. Usually it's at the end. But it doesn't take long to start finding signs. Seeing the asterisk here on the floor of the forest. And I hear water running so we're going to go this way. This is an area for the forest that I've not been yet. Oh, this is interesting. So, there's a bust here. This tree's busted. And that tree is busted probably five or six feet in the air right there. Notice how there's trees that are the same size, smaller. It's, it's not busted like that. Same with that one. Okay, let's keep moving. Keep moving. Uh, you can see like all the, the burn marks here and there. I think what it was is they do controlled burns in here once in a while to uh, get rid of all that uh, the underbrush that builds up but you can kind of see the evidence of that now there's a creek bed there but no water So I just found this little runoff creek and uh, looks like it's flowing uh, towards the uh, Kaimichi River. Um, well, it's new as in, it's new to me, so it's about the little things, right? Anyway, this is probably the most beautiful I've seen. I usually catch the foliage at the end, not at the beginning. So. Enjoy it. I mean, it's been a crazy year. <clears throat> and
think no matter what, whether we find anything interesting or not. It's always good to uh, make a trip into the woods and lose your mind and find your soul, so to speak, right? up top I thought this I thought I could hear running water but from up top it looks like this creeks dry because the way the water is so obscured the way it runs through these rocks you really can't tell all right so I like this, just from the road. I mean, like, right here's the road. And it's coming around the corner, there's this, this X. Right here. So obvious. It's like, you know, saying, do not enter here. I like how it's tucked in behind those trees there. It's cool. So just out of curiosity. Oh wow, this is cool. far away, but, wow. Alright, well, anyway, I just wanted to capture that, I just thought that was neat very obvious the way it wraps around that tree there okay. walk under for good luck right All the minerals, and these rocks, they just sort of glitter. All right. So this is called Big Cedar Creek. Flow south and runs into the Kaimichi River. I would just kind of follow it to its end. It actually uh, meets or <coughs> connects to the Kaimichi River. We'll see what happens.
there on the floor. Kind of hairy, isn't it? Might go down the way we came and then go to the river. I think, it'd be easier. I think so. It seemed, it seemed to be. Uh... Yeah, this stuff's kind of hairy. It's getting, it's getting, it's getting thick. Right, stop right there. I'm gonna take a picture of you guys for that. that